Hey guys, this is Sony HTS20R soundbar with wired subwoofer and two rear speakers. What I want to do is to show you how to connect this soundbar to your TV. Optical cable is included in the packaging. So if you take the optical cable, then you go at the back. The ports for the connections are at the back. On your right is optical TV in. The center one is HDMI out tv act the the one on the left is analog or aux so we want to connect this using optical cable go at the back and connect it to optical in tv in optical and it's in then you take the other part of the optical cable go to your tv at the back of your tv and hook it up to optical optical digital audio out optical digital audio out and the cable is in then plug the tv to the power now I'm going to turn this subwoofer back Now, the next thing you need to do is you need to switch the subwoofer on. Or if the subwoofer is on, then use the input to select TV. So you need to select, leave it to the TV. When you select optical, you need to make sure it's in TV. So switch the TV on and the TV is on. Then you need to go to your TV settings. Use the gear button to select the TV settings. Scroll down to the sound. If you look on the sound, it's showing us TV speaker. Then you need to select on the sound. Then scroll to the side to optical. Optical out device, select on it. So it's connected. And when it's in optical, then use the sound by remote to increase the volume. This is the audio. Prime Ministership to carry out what he's been saying he believes this country needs for some time, which is a reset of the UK's relationship with Europe. So what now I want us to go to YouTube, go to the home. It's music. From the from the remote control you can select voice night mode music standard auto sound cinema and voice on and off you can also increase the subwoofer or decrease the subwoofer subwoofer the maximum is plus 12 the minimum is zero If you want to check if this is an optical select your TV settings then scroll down to the sound scroll down to the sound showing us optical out device so the sound is showing us optical out device from the subwoofer it will show you TV so this is how to hook this up how to hook this sound back to your TV via optical cable if you're happy with this please do me a favor 
like share and subscribe it help the channel if you select optical out device if the sound bar is not in optical then you need to scroll to the side and look for where it's written optical and select on it for you to be able to connect this sound bar to your tv using optical cable i'm going to show you how to connect this sound bar to your tv using hdmi cable hdmi cable is not included in the packaging optical cable is included in the packaging so if you go at the back the port for the sound bar is on top of the subwoofer so you take the hdmi cable you connect it to hdmi out tv arc the port is on the center connect it to hdmi out tv arc the port is on the center one optical is on the right analog which is aux is on the left so make sure the cable is on the center then you take the other part of the cable go to your tv so go to the back of the tv hook it up to hdmi into e arc and it's in then the next thing you need to do is the next thing you need to do is you need to switch the sound bar on and select tv once you switch it on it will tell you wait please wait then use the input to select tv tv showing us tv now switch the tv on this is actually connected if you want to know then select the tv settings scroll down to the sound sound is showing us hdmi art device the sound is showing us hdmi art device if it is not hdmi then you need to select on the sound and scroll to the side and look for where it's written hdmi arc but this is how to hook this up the same thing is applicable to optical cable so now this is connected via hdmi and it will show you tv from the subwoofer when it's in hdmi you can control the volume using the soundbar remote likewise using the tv remote control and so this is the tv remote um, and you can see another further two senior democrats in the u.s congress senate the, the volume is increasing and house majority leader hakeem jeff see the volume is crazy with tv remote likewise so, with the soundbar remote to move on. Nancy Pelosi, the former uh, House Speaker, has also privately told him apparently uh, that um, that he should step down. And you contrast that with these pictures. That you now, the next thing we need to do is we want to go to YouTube. Mm -hmm. Select cinema. This is mu music. This is voice. Night mode. So when you select the specific mode, you need to keep an eye on the top of the subwoofer. This is where the display information is. So you need to keep an eye on top here. And when you connect it, the sound bar to TV via HDMI or optical, you will make sure it's in TV. So this is how to hook this up. I'm happy with this sound bar. It deserves your attention. It's value for money. So this is how to hook this up to your TV using HDMI cable. What I want to do is to show you how, how to connect this sound bar to TV. This is LG TV or any particular TV via Bluetooth. What you need to do is you need to use the sound bar remote control or you select BT from the subwoofer. Use the input to select BT and it's showing us BT. Then you wait, you will see BT pairing. Bluetooth is highlighting. And once you select Bluetooth, you need to wait for it to show pairing. Now the Bluetooth is showing us pairing and highlighting blue, looking for available Bluetooth device. 
Now the next thing we need to do is you need to go to your TV settings, use the TV remote, go to the gear button and select TV settings. Now scroll down to the sound, it's going to show us HDMI, showing us HDMI add device. We need to select on the sound, then we need to scroll to the side left or right and look for Bluetooth device. Then scroll down to device list, select enter and now it's searching for available Bluetooth device. Here we go. HTS20R is found so then you need to select on it and it's connecting it's connected HTS20R is connected and if you look on top here it will show you it's connected and it's currently showing us mute you just need to select increase the volume this is the audio And when it's in Bluetooth, you can control the volume using the two remote control, using the TV remote or soundbar remote. If you want to select a specific mode, then you need to use the soundbar remote to select the mode. Let's be severe enough to weather the aspirations of Rory McIlroy. This TV. Manchester Police custody uncovers more evidence of humiliation. And children across the region miss over a million school days due to unauthorised... I need to avoid the geography questions, that's what I need to do. I'll get the right answers on the geography questions. Right answers, just stay in, Jody. <laughs> Thank you very much, guys. This is how to connect this soundbar to your TV via Bluetooth. Thank you very much indeed, and stay blessed. Thank you.